Good morning, y'all. It is now Monday again. Feels like the weekend flew by. What we did this weekend was pretty big, honestly. For me, what I believe. We got sweats and hoodies. We had the website fully up and I'm happy with how it looks. Another day, another dollar. I was gonna read that book right there, but I'm pretty tired, so I'm gonna take a nap. Just like that, we're done with this job site. Damn, that shit looks clean, not gonna lie. Let's see where they send us tomorrow. We did get some recyclables, so let's also see how much we get from that. Uh, maybe today or tomorrow, we'll see. Because we also have some more at home. All we really gotta do is wait to see where they send us tomorrow. And today we do have a couple of things to do, so let's not procrastinate. But I've been getting really, really, really tired after work. Someone's excited. You excited? You excited? Brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how you know it was a good run, huh? I don't know what I've recorded so far today. Today just flew by. Honestly, procrastinated the whole day since I got home. Actually, no, because I went on a run with my dogs. I took a cold shower, but I did not learn at all. I didn't read. I didn't meditate. It's it's all it's all my fault. I want to get back on my non-negotiables, but I haven't been treating my body the right way. I haven't been feeding my body the right nutrients, and we've been over this already. Oh, it's so triggering. So here is a sit down video once again let's talk about my goals for the last 90 days well now basically last 26 days because tomorrow is gonna be the 4th of june already time is flying and i'm wasting a lot of time i don't want to blame my job but bro i be coming dead tired from work especially after driving a, such a long drive it sucks Unfortunately, that's what we got to do if we really want to make that bread. In the last video or the video before that, I was telling you guys how I was going broke for this clothing brand, which in reality, I'm not really going broke for my clothing brand. I'm still making income. The reason I said that was because I spent my whole paycheck on the clothing brand, which was planned and expected. I had planned on doing that even if I haven't, if I didn't tell you guys. The whole plan was to spend the last pavilion wage check on the clothing brand because I didn't know if I was going to continue working at pavilion wage. Today was the last day at Long Beach and for those of you that don't know, that is my first job site. That is where I started when I got hired for this construction job but once i started this 90 day challenge we went to a new job site which was pavilion wage a higher paying job site and we were able to make moves with our net worth improving it from negative 22,000 to negative 18,000, which is incredible we could have done better but it's okay i'm happy with the progress we have made so far towards the end we could have added a little bit more but then i started focusing on this strictly business and the reason i started focusing on strictly business is one because i don't want to be working construction my whole life so i want to build something right now when i have money when i have people that i'm able to sell it to a lot of people from construction really like it a lot of people that i know really like it a lot of you guys watching really like it so why wouldn't i focus on it when i guess the demand is there but going back to feeding myself the right nutrients and also being more disciplined that is the main priority and main goals for next month for this month that we are now in which is mind-blowing i can't believe how fast time is flying but how am i gonna do that well honestly i don't know because if i did i would have already been doing it in all honesty i'll be completely transparent with you guys i'm pretty sure you guys already know i'm a mess <laughs> like it may seem like i have all of my shit together but there's so much that goes on in my mind so many plans that i have and i know eventually everything is gonna play out and plan out but at the same time i'm i'm going through this day by day as well if i would know better i'd be in a better position i know i'm trying my best to have the best mindset at least i'm able to understand that as well because a lot of people are always in denial and all of that stuff but continue daily uploading obviously Obviously, um, I do want to live stream more. I have been live streaming. I've already live streamed more the past three days than the whole month last month. I'm going to be live streaming myself work. Today, I was supposed to live stream myself posting things on eBay and all that stuff, but I got caught up. I got a little lazy to set up the tripod above. 
I kind of didn't want to be taking pictures. I didn't know how this live stream would come out. There were too many factors that came about that stopped me from streaming, obviously. It's all my fault that I didn't stream. It's all my fault I didn't post things on eBay to sell. It's all my fault I procrastinated. It's all my fault I watched hella fucking videos and I hate it. I genuinely hate it. So here's what I'm going to be doing for the next 30 days. I am going to be living off a $100 budget every single week. Do you know what that means? No more weed for starters, at least not spending on it. Doesn't mean I can't smoke, but that just means obviously I'm gonna be smoking less, which is actually pretty good. I don't like that I have weed disposable for myself at any time. Sometimes it's better when somebody else has it. Maybe in the future, I when I go back to buying weed, I might not be the one holding on to it. It might just be when I go to, with the homies or something like that, because I smoke too much sometimes. Sometimes, I'll admit it, I'll admit it, but I guess it takes some guts to admit when you're wrong or when you got a problem. I do have a problem, but I don't think Bud is the problem. I'm the problem, obviously. I should be able to control myself, which is why I'm going to be going at least the next seven days without smoking. If I do smoke afterwards, it's not going to be. But other than that, we are also obviously going to be focusing on our clothing brand. My only goal for the end of this month is to launch every color that I plan on launching and double down on promoting those colors for this month and next month, July. With the hundred dollar budget the rest of it is going to be going in either either into my bills or into my debt or just staying in my bank account i'm just gonna try not to spend money at all the only time money is coming out of my bank account is sending the hundred dollars to my cash app and my cash app is the only thing i'm gonna be spending with and that brings me on to the next thing speaking of a hundred dollars we are about to have a challenge not the hundred dollar budget challenge but the zero to a thousand dollar challenge right now we have this right here 55 cents 20 25 26 27 we have 27 dollars in the zero to a thousand dollar challenge the money that is made from here is can only be used to flip or to save up the whole point is obviously to come up from zero dollars the money that counts for this can be recycling because anybody's able to recycle pick up some bottles off of the ground maybe off of some trashes and you'll be able to get a couple bucks another way is going to be through reselling that brings me on to the next topic the real world yes i'm still going to be watching the real world the past couple of days maybe weeks i don't even remember when the last time i watched it was but i haven't really been watching the real world but i really do want to go back and change my strategy because i feel like what i was watching it is helpful but it isn't what i need at the moment at the moment i need to learn about e-commerce maybe a little bit of content creation but we need to start focusing on those skills so we can translate that into the clothing brand and final thing about the clothing brand i really do want to start promoting tiktoks and reels for the clothing brand because that is how it is obviously going to be popping off other than that i appreciate you guys for watching i'm sorry for letting you guys down by not being productive it just sucks because i guess i claim to be hella productive and there are days where like today where i'm not productive and i really got nothing to show for all i really got is myself talking to this camera explaining why i didn't do anything at least i exported the video and have it uploading right now at 9:51. So that's probably the earliest we've uploaded in a while. Right now, I'm honestly about to go to sleep. Um, tomorrow, we are going to be sent to a new job site. I do believe this one is Pavilion Wage. Let's hope. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Keep up to date and see if it's a Pavilion Wage or not to see how our paychecks come out and to see where the money from those paychecks go. <sighs> Appreciate you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Don't forget to stay positive and enjoy the vibes. Cop your strictly business too. SBClothing.shop. Let's go. I was going to go to sleep, but my girl came home hungry. So she ended up buying both of us Wingstop. Shout out to her for always buying food. But with this $100 challenge, I am going to have to start saying no. Just so it could be fair.